Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the Uncle Bandit stream. I hope everyone's doing well and staying safe out there. Uh, today's been a rather low-key day, actually. I, uh... I don't know. I got to get a bunch of rest, and I got to... I don't know. Turn off my brain a little bit. And, uh... You know, those are nice days. Those are nice days. Speaking of nice days, today we are continuing our playthrough of Lunar Silver Star Story Complete. So without further ado, let us hop back into the video verse. So uh, when we last left off, we ended up in Paul. Uh, we are trying to get to the Black Dragon. That's our current goal. Squeak, slam. Squeak, slam. There's so many sick people in the village, there aren't enough blankets for them all. That's why we're working so fast to make more. Yeah, I need to find uh, his tent. Actually, hold on. Is there something... Oh yeah, was I looking for a shop in here? The Elder of Pal. I would welcome you to our village, but you are unfortunate enough to come at a time of great crisis. The village singer was kidnapped by the Vile tribe, and a terrible disease is spreading among us. I suggest you leave before you suffer any misfortune. Well, I mean, I'm already here, so... The medicine I made for the village isn't helping anyone. But if you want to buy some anyway, go right ahead. Huh. Yeah, no keep that. Oh, wait, hold on. Buy nine of them, just in case I run into a, uh... Run into, like, an actual weapon shop. Doesn't look good to me. Perhaps you should come back and check on them later. Uh... Yeah, no, I don't see any sort of shop. Hey, pal. Or er, Tempest. Go. Tempest. Alex. Welcome to Pal, home of the Prairie Tribe. You're the first person to make us feel welcome. We noticed that the necklace you gave Alex was a carving of the Black Dragon. We're looking for the dragon, and we're wondering if you know where it is. Indeed. The Black Dragon Fortress is our sacred ground, and protecting it is the sworn duty of our people. I can't keep something this important to you, Tempest. Alex, I gave you this necklace out of respect and gratitude. Why won't you accept it? We don't mean any disrespect. Ugh. We don't mean any disrespect. We just think that you're going to need it more than we do. I will not take back your gift, but I will hold on to it for you. Is that a fair compromise? I'm glad you came here, Alex. I enjoy your your company, and that of your friends as well. But you should go, for Pow is in the grip of a great evil. This is the voice of the Dark Songstress, the woman whose voice has unleashed a plague. Alex, this voice, it can't be. Huh? 
Kyle, I don't feel so good. No, not my healer! <laughs> Very funny, Jess. You better get up before I decide to tickle you to death. Jess? Jess? Mia! I'm sorry, Alex. This is just as I feared. Now your friends are afflicted as well. Fresca has been searching for the source of the songs. Once we find it, we'll silence the songstress forever. I found her, Tempest. The songs are coming from inside the Black Dragon Fortress. I knew you'd find her. Fresca, are you... Fresca? No! Ugh. Be strong, Fresca. I shall find that the dark songstress and snap her accursed neck. Tempest, wait up! Tempest is very strong, but not strong enough to defeat the monsters inside the fortress. Please tell the Elder what has happened, and help Tempest. Help my dear... Because it was just us. Uh... Give me like half a second. You know, what do I have for items? While I'm thinking about it. Yeah, I don't want to run out. Tempest went to the Black Dragon Fortress by himself. I can't believe he would forsake his duty as chief. I sense an enormous magical force within the fortress. No way he can survive. We're Tempest's friends. I won't help him if you let us into the fortress. Hmm. Fine. Uh, go do that. I, I didn't look at the text. Cannot afford to lose Tempest in advance of the battle with the vile tribe that is sure to come. He may be reckless, but he is also our finest warrior. The shrine is to the east side of the village. Take care, travelers. Hey, you know, I'll try. Oh, I see it. See? I knew our elder would give you permission. Well, all right, I had no idea who would. he would. Just get in there and find Tempest. Yeah. I'm gonna throw a save in here. Tempest, where are you? Oh. Huh. I swear that that's there. Oh, yeah, we're just in the dungeon now. <laughs> Alright, let's fight. Wait. Nipple Yanker? And Hellraiser. Check this out. Insanity. Ow. Check this out. Check this out. Well, uh, we live. We got a herb out of it. That's something. I don't know who the game gave it. Oh, okay. Yeah, 
Yeah, what's your deal? Let's fight. Oh, it's just a bunch of these. Cool. Check this out. Zap. Yeah, go get him. Ah. Ah. Oh, nice. Check this out. Yeah, go get him. Nice. Alright, good stuff. Got another uh, herb drop. Very good. Got dragon bandana. I mean, who needs luck anyway? You know what? Honestly, you can't really think of a game where, like, luck, where, like, a luck stat has been particularly, like, check this out, impactful. You know what I mean? They I mean, made it's just me. All right, perfect. Bunch more uh, healing items. I guess they're uh, doing that to compensate for the fact that my healer is gone. Which, I gotta say, is a rather cool thing for the game to do. I'm also kind of glad that I went and got a uh, healing uh, stuff. Nice. A lot more herbs. And mainly herbs are not what I'm particularly worried about. Um, rainbow. Huh. Oh, wow. Okay. Sure. Yeah, sure, whatever. Check this out. All right, good. Oh, uh, that one's sweet now. Cool. Very good. Yeah, having our uh, frontliners have healing rings is just 
like, stupidly useful. You know what I mean? Like, unbelievably useful thing to have. Oh, okay, well... Nice. Yeah, having them uh, put enemies to sleep is really nice. Get that uh, double damage in there. Or almost double damage. Well, I don't know. I I guess with the way this game handles damage values. Angel ring. Very good. gained a level. Love to see it. Uh, a magic power is being sucked into the chest. It's a trap. Oh. Extremely rude. Okay, so some of the chests are trapped, I guess. Who's that, Alex? Is it? Hail, Tempest! You made it, and your time is perfect. I've never seen monsters like these within the black walls within the walls of the Black Dragon Fortress. These, this holy sanctum has been desecrated by the Black Songstress. And by Galleon, the evil slug slime trails all over this place. You're right. Now all we gotta do is find them. Indeed. Let's hurry. Ah, I got a silver light. Um, you know what? We'll be good. All right, bros. Let's go do bro thing. That is horrifying. Slice of dead. Oh, wow. Okay. Alright, cool. Oh. Dude. Well, we live. Okay, um... Yeah. Alright, let's fight. Come on, let's fight. Oh dear. 
You know what? I'm already, uh... Hold on. I'm already kind of in a rough spot. Oh, well. Well, I got one of them. Oh, dude. Oh, that sucks. You know, out of uh, curiosity, I wonder what, uh... I wonder if I can equip uh, anything to Tempest. Or if that'd be, like, any better. Oh, I can't even access his inventory. I just think that doesn't really work. You know what I mean? Nice. All right, cool. We're uh, we're hanging in there. Oh, it's another one. I mean, at least we bought a bunch of, like, lights, and also, uh, also we got, uh, the silver lights. Which we can, uh, we can use it. Yeah, go get him. Oh, Kyle got a level. Oh, uh, how nice. Ah, I should have healed before. Eh, it's fine. Live or not. Come on, get back on your feet. Oh, well, okay. We even got an angel tier. Ash got a level up. Thunderbolt. Oh, is this like an actual uh, single target spell or, or no? If so, that'd be pretty great. Um... Oh, yeah. Finally learned a single target spell. It only took 
34 levels. Yeah, we have more than enough to cover if we need it. Yeah, those things hit hard. No denying. Great stuff. All right, nice. Well, hold on. Just, uh, I'm just a little wary. Yeah, I got stuck on a thing. Double crit. Triple crit. Sweet, big damage. Nice. Alright, cool. Cool, cool. Okay, maybe we think a little bit. I'm just trying to think of, like, what the best path is. Yeah, I just kind of take damage from these guys, no matter what. Oh, nice. That's awesome, actually. Yeah, get Tempest back up. All right, we got a herb. Good, good. Oh my goodness. Yeah. 
Yeah, I kinda hoping for the best. Nice. I mean, that's less nice, but there's not much I can really do about it. Hey! Got another uh, Angel's Tear. I will say what's kind of a shame is that you can't really tell between trapped chests and non-trapped. You know what I mean? Um... Awesome, but whatever. Ah, rude. Ah, there we go. Very good. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Healing nut. Very nice. Yeah, we should have a lot of these things. <laughs> All right, what are we fighting? Oh. Yeah, you seem bad. Let's go get him. Hey. All right, very nice, very cool. Well, I guess it doesn't matter because basically have no MP. So, can't steal what I don't have. I 
think I am gonna do one thing, though, for this upcoming fight. <laughs> we're, uh, we're just gonna see what this, what happens here. Check this out. Knocking. Yeah. All right, good. Also good. Alright, let's uh, just go get him. Alright, we're uh, we're doing it. Let's hope that this one is an item. Oh yeah, it does. Basically, I don't know what the top of this cave is going to look like. So I'm kind of saving as I'm progressing. Yeah, especially if it's going to do this. Really? Weird, but all right. actually not too bad. I'm assuming it can get worse, but yeah, that, that wasn't a problem at all. Two herbs and a healing nut. Ooh, boy. Oh, nice. That's actually really, really nice. Yeah, let's fight. Honestly, this has been going a lot better than I expected. Like, honestly, like, losing out on our healer and our main, like, single target spell damage person is, uh... Like, you'd think that'd be a problem, but it really hasn't. Hey, Null, you look like you've seen a ghost. Uh, no, Kyle. I thought I heard someone speaking with a deep voice. Oh. You have come. I have heard of your quest to become the Dragon Master, young Alex. 
I am the dragon you seek. What? But your... My physical form has been stolen by the magic of the Black Songstress. Now I exist only as a spirit. Though I am fighting her power, the Songstress will soon be able to control the body she stole from me. And she intends to use it to spread her black power to every corner of the world. Alex, you must destroy my flesh before that happens. It is the only sure way to prevent this plague from unfolding. But if your body dies, Alex can't become the Dragon Master. Don't worry, little one. The power of my soul will always exist within my armor. Ooh. Power up! Alex, buddy, you're looking good. How does it feel to be the new Dragon Master? Until you undergo my trial, Alex, you cannot become the Dragon Master. But how can I take the trial when you're not here to give it? My trial is simple. Just only find the purity within your own heart, Alex. When that purity is revealed, your armor will shine bright, and the trial shall be complete. You will at last become the Dragon Master our world so desperately. Purity. Alex, Purity. Yeah, that definitely feels like we're close to a fight. Just in case there's any more, like, enemies. Oh, yeah, like, right there. All right, let's fight. might be bad. Oh, well. That wasn't too bad at all. No. Oh, nice. Okay. Starlight out of that. Alex gained a level. Alright, sick. Uh, okay. Dragon Master's armor. Dark armor. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, I think I see that. I mean, it reduces the magic resistance, which I'm not super thrilled about. But, you know, it is what it is.
actually not great. Uh, yeah, it's not great. I mean, we can hang in there. I just, we just gotta, yeah. Just gotta wail on him. Ta-da! Yeah, get him back. Tempest gained a level. Alright, cool. Cool, cool. Hmm. Blade O Evil. Yeah, I guess we're just missing a uh, dark helmet. Okay, I got a, I got a feeling about this spot. And then what I think I'll do is I'll kind of... Oh no, we have all these silver lights. We might as well use them. Right? Right. Okay, so that'll get us out of here. And yeah, that looks like a fight. That looks like a fight, chat. Whoa, hold on. Yeah, it looks like, like a fight. The Black Songstress. Luna? Luna. Luna! Oh yeah, she is... That is, uh, that is mind control eyes right there. You can tell. Luna, run! Alex, what's wrong with her? Come on, Alex. We have to slay this thing before it harms anyone else. No, no, Tempest, we can't. We can and we will. You saw what her song did to your friends in the village and to Fresca. To spare the black songstresses to throw away their lives. What man who, des who desires to be a hero would let that happen? Alex has been adventuring all this time to save Luna. She's not evil. Her songs are bright and beautiful. And I know Alex can break the spell Galleon's placed on her. All right, Alex. I owe you this chance, and I understand your feelings. But one chance is all I will allow you. And if you are unable to break the spell, she must be slain. 
She must, Alex. Luna. Luna, it's me, Alex. Get away. Stand back. Magic Emperor Galleon. No, wait. I'm thrilled you made it, boy. Ooh. Luna's voice has improved tremendously since you last heard her. In fact, my dear, why don't you let your acquaintances hear a tune for Auld Lang Sin? What? I'm sure they're breathless in anticipation, and we wouldn't want to disappoint them. Yes, Master Galleon. Ah! ah! It burns! My head! It's in my head! Get it out! Shut her up, Alex. Now we're all, we're all dead. Luna, please stop. Look at what you're doing to us. Luna. Yes, my sweet fountain of despair. Let the world hear your mournful call. A great power is yet locked deep within your soul, dear. Stretch out your alabaster skin and unleash the song that will unfetter it. And if the humans before us must perish as a consequence, so be it. I can't control my body. Try to close your ears to fight it. Luna. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, I mean, we're here. I mean, I'm paralyzed and can't really do anything, so, you know. You know how it be. You know, with the healing rings, it's gonna take a while, huh? Oh, we lost Nash. We can't do anything, Alex. We're powerless against her. You know what to do. Luna is lost to you, Alex. Now finish her before our world pays the price for your indecision. What are we gonna do? I don't believe you've forgotten about us, Luna. I don't believe you're evil, no matter how hard Galleon tries to change you. Luna. Oh. The Ocarina of Purity? Luna! Oh! Alex? It's you, Alex. Luna. Alex, I... I... Oh, if only it were that easy. Wouldn't that be the happy ending everyone paid to see? Uh. No, get away from me! Uh, Alex, help me! I will say that you have impressed me with your resolve, Dragon Boy. I designed my magic to destroy every fragment of Luna's memory. Yet you have revived it with nothing more than a pathetic little ditty. Luna! Alex! Oh, Alex! Of course, all your efforts are meaningless. Events far be beyond your understanding have been set into motion, and all the power of this world will soon be mine to control. Let her go, Galleon. Let her go now! If you think I can be intimidated by your little yell, Dragon Boy, you are even more of a simpleton than I first believed. Heed my command, Black Dragon. Devour these pathetic children. Stop! Oh. <laughs> Alex! Luna! The Black Dragon armor. It's glowing. And now, back to the task at hand. 
Ah! Guna, no! Ooh. Ooh. Yo, let's go! Transform! Whoa! The power of the dragons! Yo, let's go! My weird helmet, let's go! <laughs> Well, I'm here. Nice. I summon Dragon Master with uh, with fifteen hundred attack points. Alex, look at you. Get away from her, Galleon. Get away from her or die. Yeah, let's fight. Dimension attack. Actually, I think what we'll do is we'll do a uh, round of buffs. Right, round of buffs. Uh, just do Check something. This out. 185, cool. Uh. Oh! Ow! Alright, we, we gotta go, like, now. Yeah, those are all area of effect, which aren't, isn't really useful to us. Uh, just gonna do something. Check this out! Nice! Yeah, 500 damage is rather nice. Yeah, nice try. Yeah, just use the arrow attack. Check this out. Yeah, we're hitting them. Okay, rude. Uh, losing out on that damage output is kind of annoying. Check but... this out. I mean, it won't hang in there. I mean, I am kind of concerned about uh, being able to deal good damage. Come on, get back on your feet. Hey, what? Oh, oh. Okay, well, that's that's good. Okay, maybe using the flash arrow is a good Check thing. this out. Yeah, it'd be great if Kyle wasn't targeted here. 
Not Come really on. what I meant. Get back but, on your okay. feet. Whatever. Yeah, hit Check him as hard out. as you can. Off, I'll be surprised. Check this out. I mean, we might. We might. Nice. Clutched it out, baby. Let's go. That's a lot of XP. Ash gained a level. Kyle gained a level. All right, nice. You continue to amaze. Well, perhaps that's too strong of a word. You continue to amuse me, young dragon boy. Here you are, a supposed hero like Dine, and yet the most basic truths still elude you. You can't destroy me. That power has been and shall remain out of your reach. What's better, you can't even help your beloved Luna. You finally achieved your lifelong dream. For what? For nothing more than idle amusement of one you have grown to detest. That would be me in case you weren't keeping notes, Dragon Boy. But enough of that. Luna! Yes. Yes, Magic Emperor. Luna! The time has come for us to depart this little soiree. Be a deer and summon the coach. Yes. Awaken Black Dragon. Isn't this amusing? You're the Dragon Master, and yet I seem to control the dragons. Ah! <laughs> Stop! Well, off it goes. If you still want Luna back, Dragon Boy, I have arranged a meeting at the Grindery. I'm confident we can work out some kind of final arrangement here. Or there. Uh, come back! Though I find your demeanor quite endearing, I'm afraid you aren't really in a position to be commanding anyone at this juncture. I'm afraid you'll just have to come to us, Dragon Boy. See you at the frontier. 
<laughs> Goodbye. See you later. Luna. No. Uh, yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, I can't even escape here. Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm just kind of thinking about this just a little bit. Oh, is it just because I was in that one area? Like, actually? Oh, yeah, that's exactly what it is. Well... Uh, I am not very smart, but that's okay. Back to my tent, Alex. We have to see if Fresca and your friends are all right. Yeah, let's see if they're all right. Are we ready to go? Anytime you are, Fresca. I hope we find them soon. Hey, how's it going? Fresca. Tempest. I'm so happy you're all right. I've never been so worried. Mia. Jessica. You took so long, we thought you guys might be lost in the fortress. So you were headed there to look for you. You had us so worried, man. The same goes for us, Mia. When I saw you collapse, I feared the worst. So what did you find in the fortress? You found Alex's girlfriend. You found that she was the Dark Songstress. No! No! Yes, but it was definitely Luna. Not the Luna I know. Galleon is manipulating her. I'm sure of it, Mia. I've seen Galleon control the minds of others during his experiments for the guild. Forcing Luna to obey him would be all too easy. Where is Luna now? She left with Galleon and the Black Dragon to a place called Grindery. In the frontier. What's this about the frontier? Bike. Bike. Whoa. How have you been, Tempest? Are you keeping up with your archery practice? Of course. Thanks to your instruction, I've become the best in the prairie. Ha ha ha! I didn't think you were just a little brat when I first came to this village. But I'm not here to catch up on old times. Tempest, I'm here to speak with Alex. Congratulations, Alex. You've gained the Black Dragon armor. Feels good, eh? Like, have you talked to Might? Do you know if he's done with the airship yet? Not yet, no. I think he's on the verge of completion. Why don't you return to the tower and ask him yourself? I can't believe it. We're going to be flying to the frontier. We're going to be flying to Luna. I can't wait. You are a true warrior, Alex. The Magic Emperor will be no match for your strength. Thank you. I have another gift for you, Alex, and I think you'll find it to your liking. Ooh, a Master Sword. Jeez, why don't I get, ever get presents like that? Tempest. I insist, Alex. This weapon has been passed from chief to chief for many generations. But I'm an archer, Alex, not a swordsman. Whereas you seem to prefer a sharp blade. And this is as sharp a blade as you'll ever find. What's wrong, Alex? You don't have to worry about might. I'm sure he'll remember you. I'm going to stay here and have a few bowls of pal mal. Looks disgusting, but it's delicious. Besides, you think I want to go to the frontier? <laughs> That's way too dangerous. Ha ha ha. I ain't going there. Screw that. I always knew Tempest would save me. He would do anything for me. He would die for me. Tempest is never stronger than when he fights to protect the people he loves. And I'm honored to be loved by him. He has brought such happiness into my life. Our happiness will only grow as we start our family. 
Tempest wants me to bear him a dozen children, but I would prefer eight or nine. You know what? Respect. Twelve children? Do you want a family or a litter? Okay, so I got a sword. Ooh. Fancy sword you got there. Okay, so... I'm gonna sell off some extras. Yeah. I sure do have a lot of money. Yeah, no, jo no joke. I, I want to be as prepared with stuff as humanly possible. I want all the stacks of light. All of them. Alright, now we just gotta head to uh, the tower or whatever. I'm pretty sure I can just uh, fly there. Really. Pretty sure. Oh yeah, we're here. Hey, how's it going? You've returned, and you've brought more people with you? Bah, just tell them to stay out of my way. The damned airship isn't done yet, but it will be finished by the morning. I'll be upstairs making final adjustments, so stay here and don't touch anything. And that goes for your pack of sweet-smelling friends as well. Yeah. Yeah. He's even more charming than he made him out to be, Alex. By the way, did he happen to mention where we're supposed to sleep in here? It's all right, Nash. I'm sure he'll warm up to us in time. Let's find a place to rest. Do do do. Well, tomorrow we see the frontier. Aren't you scared, Mia? I know things. I know things you don't, Mia. I know for a fact that Galleon is immensely strong. Much stronger than you, Alex, or anyone else believes. Oh, Nash. If we choose to fight him, Mia, we're all going to die. You're probably right, Nash. And I am scared. So why are you fighting? Because it's my duty, Nash. It's my duty as the next leader of the Magic Guild to protect the goddess from harm. That's right, Mia. You're the next leader of the guild. That's why you can't just throw your life away like Alex and the others. Why don't you stay here, Mia? I'll fight Galleon in your name. Just don't do this. Thank you for your concern, Nash. But I'll be fine. Tomorrow's the day, Jess. Tomorrow's the day we take on the baddest guy in the history of the world. So, you think we're just going to scrape out a victory, or will we completely embarrass him? I think you're as overconfident as always, you big fool. <laughs> Stop it. You're getting me all excited. Kyle, what's wrong? Before you go, Jess, I have to tell you something. I have to tell you that I... That I... I can't hear you, Kyle. Your voice is trailing off. Uh, it's nothing. What? Come on, Kyle. You can't tease me like that. Tell me. I said it's nothing, Jet. Now be quiet and leave me alone. Be quiet? Is that how you treat the woman to whom you were about to confess your love? Love you? How could anyone love your squeaky voice and your bad attitude? 
My attitude is just fine until you open your big mouth, Kyle. I bet those two have been fighting with each other since the first time they met. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. So there, there was more over here. I used to think a lot about how powerless I was, Nash. Mia, that's not true. I was born to take over the Magic Guild. I was reminded of it every day in my life. But the more I pondered my destiny, the more certain I was that I could never fulfill it. I knew I could never be a great leader like my mother. I was drowning in my own fear and uncertainty, Nash. But not anymore. I finally realized what I should have known so long ago. I have to live in the present. I can't worry about what could be or what might be. I'm going to do whatever I can to make a difference right now. And when the time comes to take over the Magic Guild, I know I'll be ready. Mia, you've always been strong, but I... Alex, it's getting late. Why don't we go to sleep? That way we'll see Luna even sooner. That's a good idea. That's better than <laughs> eavesdropping on our friends. Ah, impatience, boy. Delays are temporary, but mediocrity is forever. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's not a bad thing. Is Nash going to wuss out? Face it, Alex. Even our combined strength isn't enough to match Galleon's power. It doesn't matter whether or not you're the Dragon Master. Nothing matters now. Ash? My work is done. Excellent. Let's go thrash ourselves one Magic Emperor. If we hurry, we can probably be home in time for dinner. Don't get too cocky, Kyle. We're going to be fighting Galleon and the Vile Tribe on their home turf. It doesn't matter where we fight him, Jessica. We're going to win. Nash, what's wrong? I can tell something is troubling you. We're going to fight Galleon. We're going to fight Galleon? <laughs> uh, I never heard anything so absurd in my life. Nash? You've all seen Galleon's power, and you're deluding yourselves if you think you can beat him. Dude, relax. If you travel to the frontier, you're all going to die. Don't any of you understand that? Nash, why are you saying this? What's wrong with you? What? Galleon knows everything, Mia. I've been reporting to him since the beginning? Massive traitor! What? What? Why would you do... Ugh. I'm gonna tear you to shreds, you two-faced, whiny little runt. I'm not letting you go to the frontier, Mia. I won't let you throw your life away. Check this out. Ha <laughs> <Sorry>. ha <laughs> Well, very well done. I only have one question. Which one of you wants to bleed first? I'll never forgive you for this, Nash. Never. You have only yourselves to blame. You're prisoners of foolish ambition. Ah, this is starting to feel like a bad Dr. Jones adventure. Indiana Jones? Okay. This can't... Can't be happening. I'm sorry, Mia. Touching, but unnecessary, Nash. You made the only rational choice. What the hell is he thinking? What the hell has he done? He's told Galleon about everything we've done. And now he's telling Galleon that we're going to the frontier. That damned brat destroyed my engine. I assure you it won't be a, at all easy to repair. That engine was a masterpiece. So what are you saying? Can't go to the frontier? 
Not unless you happen to know more about engine repair than I do. Hmm. Of course we don't. Who says we have to repair it at all? What do you mean, Kyle? Why fix it when we can replace it? Of course! We can use the engine from Shira's balloon. Shira? No, no, no. I assure you that anything made by him is entirely unsuitable. Sorry, old man, but we don't have time to wait for you to make repairs. Let's go back to Resin and look for the balloon. Aww. Nash, you broke the girl, the poor girl's heart. Can't believe it. That's wild. So I guess he still has loyal some loyalty to his old like master or whatever, or something. I don't know, that's... that's nuts. He was in my party and everything. I spent money on him and... for all his stuff. Oh, right, because they stole the balloon. Right. Your broken airship is at the bazaar, but, uh... nobody wants to buy it. Nobody wants to buy that hunk of junk. Steve's Guild Daily reports on the triumphant rescue of Lily, Lily, plus the top 10 cons of all time. Oh, wait, hold on. That bad woman took me away to a scary place, and it was full of monsters and it smelled funny. But there was a girl named Luna who was my friend. She helped me not be afraid. Luna. Luna. Just want the engine in the airship, huh? All right, it's all yours for 30,000 silver. What? Do you know how much brew I could buy with that kind of money? Can we, uh... I don't really care if you get the engine or not, but I'm not the one who needs it, am I? Oh, okay. All right, we'll buy it, jerk. Lost 30,000 silver. Got balloon in. Thanks, kid. Steve's Guild's gonna make me employee of the month. You're despicable. So, we spent about half our money. That's okay. Hey, that's meant to, like... Yeah, it's meant to, like, nerf us a bit before, uh, going to the frontier. Right. Because we did, uh, we did get a ton of money, so maybe, like, that's to make it not as easy to, like... To, to make it not as easy to, uh, get, get anything I want there, really. That's still nuts. This is Shira's engine. I hate to admit it, but it's good. Not as good as mine, I assure you. Ah, he could have been a great inventor with more training. But never mind that now. I'll go upstairs and install this into the airship, once I make it perfect. Which won't take long. You and your friends can wait here, and I'll remind you all not to touch anything. Yeah. Yeah. This is great, Alex. We're finally gonna make it to the frontier. What's this? Why haven't you ta all taken off yet? Long story. 
because Nash destroyed the engine of the airship. He's been working for Galleon all along. That's terrible. What about the airship itself? Oh, it's fine. Might is upstairs installing the engine from our first balloon. Well then, nothing left for us all to do but wait. Hey, are you okay? Alex, you have to understand that Nash was thinking with his heart. In his mind, he didn't believe he was betraying us. He is protecting us from harm. And now as she feels, what Nash did was so wrong. I believe in Nash. I have to believe in him. Because it would hurt me too much inside if I couldn't. Oh. That's... Oh, man. Nash is an idiot. How could he not understand the grief he's causing Mia? He should have thought about the consequences of his actions. Since when did Kyle become an expert on relationships? Good question. I'm gonna claw Nash's eyes out the next time I see him. It's not just what he's done to us, it's what he's done to Mia. She's angry, Jessica's more like a cat than I am. The frontier is a cursed land. I don't know what's out there, Alex. No one does. You certain you're ready to venture there? Of course. <laughs> I knew you wouldn't let me down, Alex. In fact, there are times when I wish I was as brave as you. Looks like Might has an announcement to make. Shadow's a bitch-ass motherfucker. <laughs> the airship is complete. Come upstairs and have a look at aerodynamic perfection. <laughs> yeah. Well, if in time I could design and build a far superior airship, but this will have to do. Hmm. Hmm. I can hardly wait to see the look on Galleon's face after I stick my boot up his boot. <laughs> That's some like real like Beavis and Butthead vocabulary. I hate to admit it, but Kyle's confidence is infectious, isn't it? I don't understand why they're so excited about what we're going to do, Alex. There's nothing cheerful to me about the thought of taking someone's life. Unless it's Nash's. Don't worry, Luna. We're finally coming. Alex. Do your best. I will. All aboard! Next stop, the frontier. Ka -chunk, ka -chunk. Disc two, disc two. We're getting disc two. Quite an amazing resemblance. What's that, Might? The one between that Alex kid and you at that age. Really? I think I was a bit more stylish than that. Stylish? Bah! If you knew what style was, you would take off that beret and burn the damn drag. Yeah! Ha 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 ha! I'm sorry, Alex. Sorry you must undo what I have done. Good luck. Godspeed, friend. Wait, what did you do? Off we go! What a horrid place. No trees, no grass, no life. This is the frontier, untouched by the hand of the goddess. So where's the vile tribe? Where's the magic emperor? The sooner we wipe them out, the sooner we can leave this nasty place. And me zoom. What's that? What's what? Oh. Alex, look at the size of that tower. 
Midgard. She's in there. So is Galleon. Ooh. Please insert disc two. Let's go. All right, I'm going to take this opportunity to take a quick break. So uh, grab a snack, grab a drink, do whatever it is you got to do, and I will be right back. And I'm back. So uh, I'm going to take a quick moment to uh, swap the discs. Yeah, that was that was quite a that was quite a reveal. I, I find that very interesting. Yeah, like. Uh Well, here we are. There it is, Jess. Are you ready? Not to steal one of your lines, Kyle, but I was born ready. Hang on, everyone. Trucking. What was that? You just bounced off thin air. Come on, Jess, we have to get through. Try it again. There's some kind of force field around it. I'll try again, but there's no guarantee we're getting through. It's not working. Please stop before we crash. Again. We could ram into that magical barrier with it a thousand times over with no effect, Jessica. So would anyone like to suggest what we should try next? Look, there's a town over there. Let's land and see if we can find another way in. 
Hey, not a bad idea. Oh, hello. It must be the new miners, right? Say, has anyone told you how much you look like... like humans? Hmm. Well, you do. I don't make ugly mugs, I just call them. Oh. Oh. Xenobia told us that obeying Galleon would benefit the Vile Tribe, and I still believe that. But being forced to work until I die of exhaustion sure doesn't benefit me. Get it? Sure. I thought about running away from here, but I know it wouldn't matter in the end. Whether I stay or flee, the result will still be death. I blame Althena and her cursed children for sending us to this wretched place. Ah. Okay, there's a doctor. Oh, I wonder if there's no, uh... Yeah, I wonder if there's no weapon shop because of, uh, where we are. Uh, I'm really sorry, but I, I have to go check on something again. I... I'm sorry, but uh, I'll, I'll be right back.
and I'm back. Uh, sorry again for that, uh, for that interruption. That's my bad. Uh, okay. I guess I'm just kind of curious as to what I should be doing. Where? Oh, drank too much. Supposed to be humans around here, but too drunk to search for them. I've been finding it really hard to drink lately. I don't know, maybe it's time for me to quit. Maybe it's tough to drink with that helmet on. You are, without question, the ugliest members of the vile tribe I've ever seen. Monsters like you give monsters like us a bad name. Pick. Sorry, but I ain't allowed to serve minors. The only ones who get drinks are those, these lousy, no good guards. I'll gladly pour brews for all of you if I didn't mean if it didn't mean getting my limbs hacked off. You know what? Fair. Yeah, I'm just kind of curious what is like here. You know what I mean? Like, so what are they mining here? You know, like, what are they, uh, what are they trying to dig up? The last tunnel we dug is shakier than a hyperactive kid on five bowls of sugar flakes. The roof's gonna crumble the next time a miner sneezes, belches, or farts inside it. Uh, okay. Like, what's this again? I'm sorry, don't hit me! I'll go back, just don't hit- You're not guards, are you? Don't tell them I'm here. I just need to rest for a few minutes. I'm so tired. So tired. Working for Galleon is a privilege. He's going to turn the ore from this mine into the ultimate weapon and take care of the humans for us. Then he'll lead us to the land of Althena and let us live in the glory of his magic. That's why I work so hard. That's why I dig until my hands bleed. Huh. All right, now where was the bar? Okay, let's see what's going on. Talon Mines, Digger of the Month. Nar Despair. Nar's motto. Dig, 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 or they'll kill you. Congratulations, Nar, and keep up the good work. Power of the Goddess will soon be ours. Oh, this is like a dungeon dungeon. Okay. I see. Yeah, before we go wandering in there, I'm making a save. We're on disc two, baby. Disc two, disc two. Hmm. Oh. You know, I have a bad feeling about this layout. Not gonna lie. I already can be directionally challenged at some times, but like... Well, at least when it comes to like mazes, you know what I mean? Like... Quite a big wind up there. Nice. A healing knife. 
Oh, is this a, uh, what are them, goblin guards? Yeah, let's fight. Stalker. Alright, cool. Less cool. A lot less cool. Summon elemental power. Take this. Alright, cool. You know, I'm surprised he's not wearing the helmet. I, th I thought he'd be wearing the helmet in his sprite, but I guess, eh, that might be too much. Like, I wonder if that's just kind of too much, uh... Not like work, but like... I don't know. Maybe it's just a pain in the butt to do. Instead of just giving him just a... a just regular pair. So I came in through here, yeah? Whoa. Oh! Oh, so that just leads around. I saw that really did. But actually, no, you come in here. Yeah, and that leads you to the one tunnel. To climb up here and go maybe this way? Ooh, okay. It's a little it's a little tricky to get a handle on like where exactly you are. We got a, uh, an Alex level up. Very, very good. Got a silver light. Yeah, I'll deal with you in... Oh, there's just nothing. Oh, uh, okay. Summon elemental power. Take this. Oh, nice. Summon elemental power. Yeah, go get them. Yeah. Good stuff. Uh, all right. I kind of want to look around a little bit more. Just because I want to make sure that I get 
like items. Fight you for some treasure. Summon elemental power. -na 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 -na. Hey, we're getting. Bum -ba -dum -bum -ba -dum. Healing nut. Oh, that's where that is? Oh. I uh, guess we're fighting a machine. Yeah, I see it. Oh, that's just a crit, too. Uh-oh. I'm trying to think if we're in trouble. Okay, well, we took out the, uh, the tank or whatever. That's at least something. Summon elemental power. Very good. Very good. All right, sick. Hmm. Dude. This place is a maze. I think my main worry is that there's gonna be like an item chest in here that I'm just gonna completely miss for one reason or another. That's gonna have like something important in it. Or maybe not like important, but like something really good. Like a piece of equipment or like just anything. Like that I think is my main goal. about this place being just a big maze. Huh? Wait, is that gold? Wait, no, it'd be a special metal, I think. Athena, lend me your power! All right, we get a big heal. Nice, uh, Kyle level up. Yeah, I guess this is just whatever they've uh, been mining here. Like, they're talking about some sort of ultimate weapon that I guess Scallion is trying to make with this uh, material. Thank <laughs> you. 
See what's in here. See, this is what I was talking about. Um, I'll say I might give it to Jessica if merely because, like. Like, I think her surviving is dead. You know what I mean? Like, her being able to survive extra hits is better for her. You know? Like... Okay, I need to figure out one. Okay, this was the tank. This was something. these things. Also, why are they called Summon brokers? Why are, why are we here? What are we doing? What's going on here? We dig for Galligan. We dig for the Vile Tribe. We dig for the Blue Star. Heave ho, heave ho. Okay, I'm digging, I'm digging. You don't have to jab me in the butt with your sword again, really. Hey, you're not a guard. Sorry about that little outburst. These days, I just kind of expect the steel spanking when someone sneaks up behind me. 
and have to see. We dig and dig until we choke on the dust and dirt. But it never stops. The digging never stops. I envy the ones who died. I envy them because they don't have to dig. Oh. We've been busting our humps for weeks, and the grindery still isn't finished. I'm beginning to wonder if it will ever be finished. Ooh. Help! Ah! Please help me! That cry came from the room we just walked through. It started an awful sound. One of the mine tunnels must have collapsed. Hurry, we must go back and try to help. Can't go back there, Jess. Are you forgetting that we're sneaking around this place? The guards see a bunch of humans running around. This, this gig is up. So what do you suggest we do? Leave the poor slave miners back there to die? Real compassionate, Mr. Nice Guy. Comments like that make me ashamed to know you. Look, Jess, I want to help too. The reality is, is that we're, if we're caught, we're just as dead as they are. I'm tired of arguing. Alex, you make the call. Do we help the miners or keep going? They must try. We must try to help them, even if what they're doing is wrong. Because if we don't, we're just the same as the Magic Emperor. None of you have a lick of common sense. Today I hear that birds of a feather flock together. Let's go. Uh, how do we help them? What do we do? Are you crazy? There's no way I'm going to help you. If I don't keep working, I'm dead too. And just stay out of our way, you gutless wonder. He's alive! You, you did it! I'm so happy. What the hell is going on here? You all know you're not supposed to stop working for any reason. Leave this fool to die and get back to work before we decide to execute the lot of you. Don't think for a second that we won't crush your worthless heads if you disobey. Remember that you were brought here because you were too weak to fight in Zenobia's hordes. You don't serve her by working in the mines. You're not fit to live anyway. Wait. Who are you? You're humans, all of you. You're correct, sir. Can you guess which one of you I'm going to kill first? Ooh. Okay, so just basic enemies. That's fine. Summon elemental power. Yeah, nothing even that different than what we've uh, been fighting before. And mainly the uh, stalkers are kind of scary because they can hit pretty hard, but I mean, I think we'll be fine. Yeah, especially if they ignore our melee people. You know what I mean? Summon elemental power. Hello. Oh, Jessica got a level. And got a range increase. Good for her. Did I ever mention how much I enjoy winning? Uh, yeah. We've heard it before. Let's get out of here before we attract any more attention. Hmm. How interesting. They saved that miner's life even knowing the danger they faced in doing so such selfless bravery in their hearts, they might yet defeat the Magic Emperor. Yeah, what's your deal? She seems so... I don't want to say, like, out of place, but, like, a weird pairing with everyone. Ah. Uh, I always feel great after doing my good deed for the day. What are you talking about? You're the one who wanted to run away, you dumb bastard. <laughs> then again, you did help when we needed it. Sorry for the name-calling.
Yeah, I'm saving after that one. Oh, oh. Where am I? Great question. These tunnels are gonna... Ooh. I mean, I guess it makes sense because this is like a mine and it's sort of easy, but... All right, let's go. Summon elemental power. Come on. I can fight you bugs all day. Look around. Yeah, I have no clue where I'm going. <laughs> no clue. Summon elemental power. some holy water. Heck yeah, brother. A refresher ring. Ooh, I kind of hope that does what I think it does. Oh, it prevents conditions. Not bad. Not bad. I have an idea. Hold on. Not that this... Uh... Yeah, that'll be good. I mean, maybe this will be fine. I mean, I'd have to, like, review that. Actually, 
Because honestly, some of it kind of sounds like stuff that would be good for, like... I don't know, just... For other people. Eh, Confuse isn't good. Summon elemental power. In the name of the goddess. All right, good. We had some sense. Ta-da! Yeah, hold on. Oh, I can wear this now. We can take this off. Put this on. I didn't realize I could wear it now. That's cool. Dude, that raises magical resistance. If I have this, which... Wait, no, I have... Which prevents condition. I like that you get healing every round. This is also good. Uh, actually, hold on. Maybe think about this just a little bit. Thirty-five. Okay. Here, here's what we'll do. this, and then... Give that to you. The reason being is because I think preventing conditions on our healer is good. Because we don't have any other real, like, secondary ways of dealing with that. Right? So, like... So, like, I think it'd just be better for, um... For her just to make sure that, like... Like, if we're ever in, like, a really bad spot, where it's like, oh, everybody has conditions, you know, she won't have conditions. She can actually, you know, do some, uh... Like, remove conditions on some other people and get back in the fight. You know what I mean? Like, I find that a, a bit... Like, that's just sort of using some foresight, I guess. But yeah, that'd be, that'd be my thought. Because, like, the two frontline guys have, um, wool. Have, uh, like, have healing. Like, they have the healing rings, which gives them HP every turn. Which counter, kinda counteracts the effects of poison. And, like, they can kinda ride out conditions if need be. At least for the most part. Because they're technically not taking as much damage every turn. Ow. Ow. Okay, well. I guess Mia has decided to do nothing.
In all fairness, though, them ignoring us to go for our magic people, our spellcasters, is uh, kind of helping us. Because they're just wasting all of their movement trying to get to them. Alright, cool. Fire Tiara. Heck yeah. I mean, it's not like a huge boost, but it's something. Okay, so we came in through here. We didn't really go up this way at all, I think. Or wait, no, go down and around. Down and around. Yeah, sure, let's fight some dudes. In the name of the goddess, get back up. Owl, owl, extremely rude. Very cool. Ooh, a holy robe. Alright, nice. Nice, nice. Blessedly informal. Okay, I kind of want to check uh, the one area with the pool of water. Just because I'm starting to get the impression that maybe that's not, like, the, de the, uh, the, like, big fight area that I assumed it was. Also, this is the wrong way. Yeah. Where was this way? Oh, yeah, okay. So this is the spot. I am going to save, just in case I run into anything. Yeah, I see. Oh, okay. I, uh, I see the bit. Yeah, I promise you can... Lend me your power! 
Alright, cool. Very cool. And we got a uh, another one of these tanks. Oh, there's two of them. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, I think we maybe try here. Bonk. Nice. Okay, cool. That was, uh, that was pretty effective. Go me. Got a healing nut. Okay, so here's a mid. What is this place? These look like markers and all. Grave markers. This must be where the miners are buried. This is what they're doing with their dead? How pathetic. All we can do is pe petition Althena to watch over them with the honor they deserve. Yeah. I don't know, I think Althena doesn't like this place very much. Just a guess. Oh, a statue! It's a statue of the goddess. What's it doing in here? Is the vile tribe... You're the ones who saved me when the tunnel collapsed. Thank you. Uh, question. How'd you get here before we did? There are many shortcuts and other passages in the mines that only we miners know about. Can you tell us why there's a statue of Althena here? I thought the vile tribe hated the goddess. This is true. We have hated Althena since she banished us to the frontier 500 years ago. The only way we can survive here with such weak magic is to look to the very goddess we hate. What irony. A warning before you go. The Vile Tribe doesn't know what you humans are really like. They want to help Galleon destroy you. Please be careful. Cheer up, Alex. I have a good feeling we'll find Luna soon. Yeah, well, that's good. So, uh, now I've wasted, like, four of those starlights, so. I mean, not that I think money is, like, a huge problem, right? Now. Well, I think the problem is our location, really. I have not seen a single item shop. Alright, let's fight. Got a level up. Very nice. We got wisdom. Yeah. Very cool. Uh-oh. It's quiet in here. We all know what that means. 
Let's get ready to rumble. Alex! Alex, I'm blind! I can't believe this. I thought that saying, that saying was just a myth. What are you talking about? The entire cave went dark. Trust me, Null, you really don't want to know what he's talking about. Enough with the wisecracks. We're in trouble here. Ah! Hey, hey! What's happening? Jessica? Mia? Oh my goodness, they stole our spellcasters again. Alex! Ugh! A cowardly act from a master of the yellow arts. Okay. Let them go before I cleave you in two, wench. Yeah. What he said, grr. Ha 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 ha. My, aren't the two of you intimidating? Give me a moment to think this over. Should I release your precious friends, or should I make use of them? Hmm, what to do? Ah, I have just the ticket. A fight. Kyle versus Alex. To save their dear friends. Should you fail to cooperate, you'll be witness to an uncomfortable execution. The only woman I take orders from is Jess, you skanky scab sucker. Oh, sticks and stones, and all that. I'm afraid your schoolyard taunts have failed to achieve the desired effect. I shall see a bloodletting. I care not whether it happens to be yours or theirs. Oh, well, you heard her, Alex. Give her what she wants. Are we fighting? Oh, this, this is bad. Uh, this feels like one of them, uh, what's the word? It, it, it feels like one of them, uh, like, tricks. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. It, it feels like a trick of some kind. Hmm. Well, let's just see what happens. Oh. Oh, okay, we're faking it. Whoa, oh man, we're fighting so hard. Oh man. Ah, oh man. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Come on, sell harder, Kyle. You gotta sell, Kyle. Come on. You gotta uphold Kayfe. Do you think you're really fooling anyone with that pathetic show? Now show me your true skills. Now. If you do not, you shall witness your friends writhing fatally before you. I... Uh, I can't... I can't do it. What? You would choose to let your friends die rather than fight to save them? I'd rather save Mia's angelic life. But there's no way I'm gonna put my life on the line for that beast chick. There's no way I'm gonna fight the Dragon Master because I don't want to lose. Kyle? What? I knew he was selfish, but I didn't know he was this bad. Oh. See, now you hurt her feelings. You're bluffing, buffoon. Look, look in my eyes and tell me I'm bluffing, Zenobia. You never had to suffer through one of Jess's temper tantrums, have you? Go ahead, finish her. I could use a little peace and quiet. Kyle, you brainless mutt. What are you saying? I don't yell at you that much. Oh, so I'm brainless? Oh, so I'm a whiner? You know what you need, Jess? You need the discipline your dad never gave you. Is that what you really think? I dare you to come up here and even try it. Uh, Kyle, this might not be the right time to vent your frustrations. Unbelievable. I have a feeling this little tent tete tet is going to be interesting. I suppose I'll kill you first then, Alex, and watch the quarrel next. Oh, thanks for the healing. 
Okay, it's broken. That's great, Jess. Now come on and get down here. Yeah, it was a bluff. Ready, Mia? Ready. Damn, it's not again. Wow, you were bluffing. <laughs> of course. The smarter they think they are, the easier it is to fool them. Not in... Not incorrect, actually. Not an incorrect, uh... Observation. Every time I have you at my mercy, you manage to escape. But not this time. Their performance is over. It's time for the final curtain to fall. Farewell. Fight this thing. Alright, let's fight this thing. Okay. Command. Uh, yeah. Just throw fire. Oh, you know what might be a good idea? By the power of Althea. Like, we're using this round to, like, buff, right? Now we might as well commit to the buff. Althea, lend me your power! Yeah, just guarantee healing every turn. Why not? Rude. Okay. Uh, what should you do? Can I just set you to AI, or like what? Uh, just kind of do things. By the power of Althena. I mean, that's usually what I do for the healer, so it's fine. Althena, lend me your power! 74. Oh, you just ran. Oh. Ooh. Oh, does that mean he can't use uh, magic? Oh, yeah, he can't use magic. No way. That's, that's rough. Yeah, well, it's a good thing I put the, the one ring on, uh, on Jessica, then. I'd much rather make sure that our healer isn't muted by that. Ow. Okay. Um. By the power Make sure we're hanging in there. Come on, team, hang in there. By the power of Althena. Althena, lend me your power. Yeah, not really doing too much to us. By the power of Althena. Yeah, just keep doing the thing. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. I ain't sure. Ah, rude. Oh, yeah, I guess they missed. Like, entirely. By the power of Althina. Yeah, I mean, this is taking a bit. But we're not really doing any, like, crazy damage to him, so it's like... Eh, that's a problem. In the name of the goddess! Thing. Why won't you go down? Oh, let's see. By the power of Go down, Fian. Althena, lend me your power! Come on. You gotta get him. Gained a level. The gained a level. Play Maria. Ooh. That sounds fancy. Jessica got a level two. Miracle Litany. Oh, is that a revival spell? I hope so. I hope so. Kyle, I never knew you were such a talented thespian. That was the best acting I've ever seen. And you ad-libbed all your dialogue. Thespian. Aren't I the wrong gender for that, Jess? <laughs> I wasn't acting. I was just speaking the truth. What? Don't tell me you're going to stand here and deny that you whine like a weak old puppy. It's so much fun to watch you two fight. I can always see the smile in your the smiles in your eyes. The only thing that's gonna be in Kyle's eyes is my fist. Thanks. I think we just crossed the line from playful to pissed. How about a truce until we find Galleon's castle, Jess? Fine, whatever. See, I'm worried that I missed stuff. That's that's the only thing. Is this, like, a way? Okay, that's an exit. I kind of want to look a bit more around, because I feel like getting turned around as much as I did might have caused me to miss stuff. I really don't want to have to do that. Or I really don't want to, like, miss... Oh, at least the enemy's been really fun. It's kind of nice. Yeah, this was where... Yeah, that one was open. Oh, there's one down there. Oh, and I didn't go up there at all. Ah, Hell Armlet. Hey, uh... Who am I giving that? Ah, okay, cool. Yeah, it just means we have to fight these tanks, which is whatever. I mean... Well, unless they throw that many at us. Uh, okay.
entire store. By the power of Athena. Oh. Very cool. Oh, very cool. Athena, you did something great there. Not gonna lie. That was that was really good. That was really good. You know, I will say, at least the Hell Armlet like, didn't really seem to, like, make much of a difference in that fight. You know, like... Like, I, like it was an equipment item for uh, Jessica, so, like... I don't really see, like... I don't know, like... Summon elemental power. Like, I don't know what would've like, improved upon that fight, if we had it. Uh, okay. Summon elemental power! Alright, cool. Hey, we got a holy water. Oh, nice. Won't, uh, won't say no to extra starlight. Of course, watch this be the moment where the game decides to, uh... Oh, silverlight. Where, uh, where the game decides to be like, oh, uh, now we're gonna provide you with all these, uh, with all these items. Just, you know. Just to, uh, or no, uh, what was I thinking? Yeah, if the game's like, oh, we're gonna give you these, uh, statues now. Just, uh. Just any time that you need him, you know? Because we felt bad about the early game, you know? So... Just gonna give you these statues before these big fights now. You know? I know that you had, like, a bunch of money and you spent a bunch of it on Starlights, but, you know, like... You don't gotta worry about that anymore. Aren't you happy? Are you thrilled about that? All right, cool. All right, now let's see if I remember how exactly we got to the one area. Was it this way, or was it another way? Oh yeah, I didn't really go in here. Oh, I got another one. I got another one! Ain't that exciting. Summon elemental power! Alright, alright. Hmm. 
right, it was this way. I will say the giant lake is a nice uh, landmark. You know what I mean? Like, it's so different from the other parts of the mine that it sort of sticks out and makes you go, ooh, I better... No. My spidey sense is tingling, sort of thing. Oh, I guess we're in. What's with the egg? What is this? Oh yeah, that's an egg. At least it sure looks like one. Let's get in there. Let's get in there. I want to get in the egg. Ooh. Uh, what a place. Oh, I can hear the grindery. The sound that will lead the vile tribe to the green earth and push the humans out into the frontier. What is this? It appears to be a protective cocoon. The walls of the sack absorb the weak magic field of the frontier and radiate the inhabitant with life-giving powers. The weaker members of the vile tribe might have to stay in cocoons all their lives. How horrible. I can't begin to imagine spending a lifetime zipped up inside a hideous flesh bag. Yeah, the vile tribe might lead difficult lives. That's no excuse for them to invade our lands and kill us. Whatever bitterness they have should be directed at Althena, not our creation. You're right, Kyle. But living like this might have stolen away whatever reason they once had. It's so cold in here, but I won't be like this much longer. Soon, it will be the human's turn to suffer. Ugh, we hate humans. We hate Althena, but we, but we want their green earth. Oh, green earth blessed by Althena. The green earth and the blue star. Soon they will be ours. Ugh. I want to leave this place and go back to the blessed lands. I want to take back what the humans stole away from us. I want it back. I want it all back. My teachers at the guild taught me that our entire world was once like the frontier. My teachers at the shrine taught me the same thing. Althena used her power to transform our world into the green earth. Because the vile tribe was engaging in evil acts, Althena sent them to the frontier. The only place where our magic could not reach. Getting a weird feeling about this place. What's wrong, Jess? You sense some kind of danger? No, Kyle, not danger. This place just feels oddly familiar. Yeah, well, I'll keep one hand on the hilt of my sword just in case. Hey, who's that? That's the goblin from the uh, the cave, from the thing. Welcome to the village of Caden. We've been waiting for you. You look like a worker from the Talon Mine. So what are you doing here? Hey, look at that. This is a shrine to Althena. That's why I felt so strange when we came in here. What's going on here? And who are you? Oh, Faisha. It's a trap. Everyone draw your weapons. No, this is not a trap, and I will not engage you at this time. You were guided here so that you could learn the way to enter Ru Ruid. The vile tribe lost many lives building that armored encampment, and it cannot be entered by any means save one. Which is? There's a hidden door to the left of the front gate. It is opened with a password that is given only to select members of the Vile Tribe. Faisha, why are you telling us all this? And why are you helping us? The Vile Tribe has been sentenced to a slow death for 500 years. From the moment we were banished to this barren wasteland, we were dying. 
and unless we claim some of Althena's power for ourselves, our end is all but certain to come about during this generation. My sister Zenobia said we must seize that power by force. Althena's will must be bent to serve our immediate need for survival. I do, however, have my reservations about her method. Instead of stealing Althena's power, I believe we can beg forgiveness. After all, we were the ones that transgressed the bounds of good. I believe that in her love and wisdom, she would welcome us back into her light. So, per pretending to be like a big shot at the, uh, the, uh, the church or whatever. Like, actually, I guess, converted her to a degree. Huh. Funny how that works. For you see, I have watched the progress and discovery you have made on your journey, and I have realized that what my sisters are doing is wrong. Why should we believe a word from the word of this, honey lips? For all we know, this is just another one of your tribal tricks. You are free to choose for yourself whether to believe what I say. I do not expect your faith in me to be easily gained back. If you insist on seeing me only as an enemy, I would not be surprised. In that face, in that case, I would have to fight all of you alongside my errant sisters, because my tribe deserves a chance at a real life in a real world. What shall we do, Alex? She really sounds like she's bearing her soul to us. I think we should trust her, Alex. I mean, she waited here for us. I don't think all of the vile tribes are bad people. That's because... That's become clear to me since we arrived on the frontier. They might look different, but they act and feel much the same as humans do. I think she deserves our trust, Alex. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I agree with Mia. All right, we believe you. The password to open the hidden door at Reed is Green Earth. It's what every member of the Vile Tribe yearns more than anything to see. It's time for you to settle the question, Alex is your strength, the strength of Althena and of her children, enough to overcome the power of the Magic Emperor. Meet with him, Alex, and hold out the answer for the whole world to see. Faisha. In. That's, that's really interesting. Because I always kind of figured she was, like, weirdly, like, out of place compared to the other two, uh... To the other two ladies, you know? Like, she seemed a bit more soft-spoken, a bit more, like... I don't know, just not as, uh... I don't know, not as, like, ready to go, like, let's fight and everything. This is Ruid. It's quite a formidable fortress, that's for certain. I doubt we could break through this door even with our combined effort. Which is why I'm glad we have the password. Okay, time for the password. Uh, does anybody, anyone remember it? I believe it was Green Earth. Perfect. Thanks, Mia. What do you think Galleon's gonna say when we find him? Oh yeah, you won't be able to speak with my hands around his throat. <laughs> Green Earth is something we all take for granted. But the Vile Tribe would do anything to live here. It's so sad. Uh, okay, I'm gonna save. I, uh, I need to get something to drink. Uh, I'll uh, let the music play here. And I'll be like five seconds.
Okay. I have a drink in my hand. Oh no. Oh no, please. Oh no! <laughs> I can't open it. Oh, I actually can't open it. Uh oh. I might have to trade it. Alright, made this one. There we go. Uh, what a game! What a game so far. I wonder uh, how far we actually are, because it seems like we're on his doorstep, you know? So, like, I'm kind of curious to see, uh, how, uh, how much is left. Right? Like, I don't know. All right, team, let's go. Fight. All right, let's see uh, a Flash Lord. By the power of Athena. You know, watch us get a uh, Ash back, but he's like at the level that he left the party, so he's like completely useless. <laughs> That worst. Yeah, they don't seem that threatening. Really. Yeah, like, whatever. Alex gained a level. Let's go. I got a silver light. Oh, we fought some. We uh, opened up the chest, and now they want to ruin our day. Jokes on them, because we're the really good. Also, I guess it was just a really good idea to go stock up on, like, items. new ones. They're, they're just uh, ones that have already been in here. That's what that is. By the power of Athena. Yeah, go get him. Okay, cool. Very cool. Oh, Starling. Yeah, sure, let's fight. Come on. Let's fight. You don't scare me. You don't scare me, Flash Lords. By the power of Athena. I don't think there's a thing you can do that can scare me. Your resistance to magic is annoying, but whatever.
Nice, nice, nice. Go get him. Kyle got a level up. Yeah, let's fight. Come on. Let's fight. I didn't hear no bell. <laughs> I didn't hear no bell. Come on. Come on. Come at me. By the power of Alcina. Oh, is it? Oh, hold on. Well, hold on. I have an idea. I wonder, would this be... No, because that increases magic endurance. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just see what happens. It might be related to like uh, item drops or something. That'd be the only thing I'd guess. Also, nice music. Yeah, go get it. I wasn't expecting that, but I mean, sure. Summon elemental power. Yeah, I mean, yeah. 
And try your hardest. Eh. Yeah, this isn't great, but... Oh, nice. Uh, less nice. But she's alive, so that's the good thing. Yeah, you are up, boy, don't you? Nice. Nice. Oh, I wonder if uh, luck affects uh, critical rate. I didn't even think of that. Why didn't I think of that? Like, at all. Eh, I kind of like Kyle with the increased magic resistance that you get from the One Ring. It just seems good to like prop that up a little bit. Just so it isn't like too low. Okay. Oh, hold on. Hit him hard. Nice. Yeah, they're trying to back off. Oh, yeah, do whatever you want. By the power of Althina. Nice. Uh, eh, okay. Uh, okay, very nice. Althina, lend me your power! Very, very nice. All right, cool. Yeah, all right, let's fight. Best you got. Wait, what am I dealing with? Buy again and master mirror. Summon elemental power. Good. Good. Nice. Look at how straightforward that was. Hmm. Oh, I can't go in there. That's a bummer. Oh, okay. Uh, short. Summon elemental power. Nice. Alright, cool. Yeah, no, we're just kind of ruining their day. There's a chest over there. Yeah, it's not like I'm worried about these things. Summon elemental power. Yeah, like, look at that. Ta-da! 
Very good, very good. Wicked magic. Yeah, I'm not really sure what the point of these mirror enemies are, because they kind of seem to do nothing. Let's continue on. Let us fight uh, this thing. Summon elemental power. Good. Yeah, her using that uh, that ice move. Basically, you'd make. Trivializes this fight to such a degree. I might even use some of the starlights that I have, just because, just so I can like get through these fights. Not that I'm really like struggling through the fights. It's just that like we have so many of them, right? I swear the song reminds me of something. I'm not sure what. Summon elemental power. Like, it reminds me of another song. And I feel like it wouldn't be one from, like, from, like, 1997 or whatever. But, or, like, the late 90s or early aughts or something. Oh, nice. Very cool. Okay, so it came in through there. So you come over here. This is nothing. Come down this way. Bunch of enemies in here. Yeah, I feel like I don't have to worry about giving her agility. You know what I mean?
All right, sick. Very cool. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised at how uh, easy these fights have been going. Like, maybe it's because Mia is doing a bunch of heavy lifting, doing these big, like, screen fill, like, spells, but... But I don't know. It seems like it's been a bit, uh, a bit easy. Oh! Her mace, uh, confers silence, I guess. Kyle got a level. And an increase to range. That's that's actually kinda nice. Is this anything? Not but it looks. Oh hello. Yeah, let's fight. Let's fight. Ooh, yeah. That galleon killer. I don't like him. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> and. You know, I wonder, do people still, like, get uh, Macho Man impressions? Is that is that something that is still in the cultural lexicon? You know? Still a thing? Yeah, I might as well fight it. It's right here, so... Four. It's not like these enemies are even that, like, threatening. Summon elemental power. Yeah, like, look at them. Ta-da! They even got a healing nut out of that. So that's a way towards something. But this is a way towards treasure. And I quite like treasure. Let's fight. By the power of Alfina. Alfina, lend me your power.
Alright, let's uh keep her Ooh. Wait, who do I give this to? To you. Just to get it out of their inventories, if anything. You know what I mean? Like... Yeah, go get him. Summon elemental power. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Yeah, quite a place we're in. Very modern looking. Summon elemental power. Bonk. Bonk. Yeah. Yeah, very cool, very cool. Let us continue. Oh, well. Alright, let's fight some uh, machines. Yeah, use the firestorm. By the power of Athena. It makes uh, dealing with the drill dudes a bit easier. Yeah. Alright, nicely done. Nicely done. Bonk. Yeah. Oh, whoops. Uh, yeah, dude, whatever. Yeah, I'm still wondering if we find Nash in here. Or if his, uh, his betrayal was absolute. Oh, man. I couldn't, uh... Okay, I'm gonna make a judgment call here. We're gonna see what this does. Oh, nice. Nice. So now we only have to deal with the drill dudes. Yeah, we just have the one. Status change. Isn't that the same as the the one thing? Oh no, prevents condition. Oh. 
I want to assist. You know what? Here, take this. Can you do anything with it? Yeah, I don't know what giving her the fortune ring really does for her. Like, truthfully. I feel like preventing statuses is really good. It just kind of feels like everybody has something. You know, like, I don't... I don't know what exactly you give anybody. It's like, it seems like their stuff is already, like, pretty darn good. Yeah, go fight him. So I guess now we get to know what the, these fights are like without uh, Mia's magic assisting us. Athena, lend me your power! Yeah, I mean, they're not much. Yeah, I think we're just good. Yeah, like, what are they gonna do? Ta-da! Mia got a level up. Jessica got a level up. Oh, boy. Oh, uh oh. Extremely rude game. I must say. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna make another judgment call here. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to do a thing. Yeah, I don't really think we have much of a shortage on MP raising items. Oh, what? Summon elemental power. Yeah, we're just kind of ruining their their day. And I don't know how thrilled I am about not having the range for that, but whatever. It's okay. Yeah, let's fight. Let's toss it. Summon elemental power.
just gotta level up and get an increased range. That's good. I wonder if we'll ever get any more uh, attacks out of the uh, out of a level up. Like number of attacks kind of increase. Does that be kind of cool? Summon elemental power. That'd be kind of cool game. I mean, you don't gotta do it, but it'd be nice. Kind of see what happens. the thing. Summon elemental power. Althena, lend me your power. Heal. Yeah, might as well try and clean these up a while. Come at me, Brill Machine. Summon Go get him. I still find that a very strange choice by the uh, by the game's Alpina, computer. You know what I mean? Like, you'd think she'd go for Flame Area, but guess not. Um, okay. Summon elemental power. This might not matter in like five seconds, but. Oh yeah. Altina, Didn't matter at all. Oh well he hit the one dude, so That's something I guess. Good. Very, very good. Oh. Yeah, this feels like a boss. 
This feels like a boss. Alright, let's fight. Well, well, well. To what do we owe the honor of this visit, humans? It's not often we receive visitors here. In fact, we discourage the practice. Who are you? My name is Ta Tabin. And this, as they say, is your lucky day. For you see, you have come at precisely the right time to witness the extraordinary. Today is the debut of my latest invention, the Mobile Magic Masher. Sounds interesting, but you might want to think twice about the name, bud. By the time we're done, you'll you'll be changing the name to Immobile. Hmm. Alas, your feeble words won't save you, human. It's time to introduce those who disobey the Magic Emperor to the true meaning of terror. I don't like the sound of that one bit. Cabin wasn't lying. There's powerful magic very close to us. I can sense it. You didn't listen to me. I warned you, but you didn't listen. How ignorant and irresponsible can you be? Oh, is that Nash? I recognize that voice. Afraid to show yourself, traitor? You should be. Afraid of you? <laughs> You're the one who's going to feel fear, Kyle. Does he have a villain outfit now? Oh, no. Oh, he's just... Inside this armor, my power is amplified beyond measure. You can't stop me. You can't even hope to slow me down. Your only choice are sub choices are submission and servitude, or failure and death. Alex, is it just me, or does Nash kind of look like a giant chicken? It does. If you value your lives, you'll cease your disobedient course and obey the Magic Emperor. Don't force him to destroy you and everything you care about. Shut up, you moron. You think I'm gonna listen to you after what you've done? I'm gonna knock you and that ridiculous get-up of yours to the blue star and back. I wasn't able to talk any sense into you before. So why should you start listening now? Now I'll have to use force. But don't fret. I shan't kill you. That comes later. And not by my hand. Check this out. Check this out. Ugh. I'm so tired. Damn you, Nash. Ugh. Mia, I don't want to hurt you. I don't want to hurt anyone. I did all this for you. Nash. You idiot. Whoa! Did you really think that doing this would make me happy? What made me happy is when you were when you were helping us, and when you were helping Alex. Don't you understand why he's trying so hard to save Luna? Don't you understand anything? Um Ah, oh, they even did the yeah. Please, Nash. Please stop this cruel charade. I I love you, Nash. But I hate what you're doing to us. I'm sorry, Mia. I really messed things up this time, didn't I? Oh, Nash. I'm sorry, Mia. And all of you. I thought I was doing what was best. But I was really thinking only about myself. I only wish I could take back everything I've done. Nash? Alas. Despite this little change of heart, the power of my invention must be known. I won't let you all depart without a minor demonstration via remote control. Hey. Behold the magic of the mobile magic masher, humans. I knew that apology was just another damn lie. You're dead, Nash. Dead! That wasn't me, Kyle. I'm not doing anything. Nash? Help me, Mia. Magic Chicken Nash. <laughs> yeah. 
Uh, welcome on in, C. I hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah, let's just do kind of our, uh, sort of our buffs, right? Oh, uh, yeah, we did get a resurrect spell. By the power of Althena. Not that this is, like, much of a healing thing, but it's... Oh, okay. Althena, lend me your power! Yeah, sure, do, uh, critical damage. Yeah, okay, well. Let's, uh, go get kick the tar out of him. But, uh, but yeah, welcome on in. I, I hope things are going well for you. Yeah, unless something changes, I think I'm just gonna do this. Just gonna do the old. Uh. Just kinda mash X and win. Oh, unless that happens. Okay. That's not good. Um. He sure does love that move. Eek. Ow. In the name of the goddess. Yeah, get her back up, please. Oh, nice. She's at full health too. Yeah, having uh, me uh, up and about is a good thing. By the power of Althena. Hit him hard. Very rude. In the name of the goddess. Huh. Okay, so she just kind of goes for that. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, okay, that did hurt. But we're living. Can't really, uh... Be mad at that. Althena, lend me your power. Yeah. How much damage can this guy take? Jessica being low on MP is pretty bad. But I don't really know. Hmm. Hey, there we go. We won the battle. Mia gained a level. Good for Mia. Jessica got a level. Good for her. Hey. Quite a disappointing performance, I must admit. Ah, well. Back to the drawing board for that one, I suppose. Enough of the games, though. The time is at hand for the main event. The unveiling of my life's work. The grindery. <laughs> I... I... Say something stupid, Nash. Give me a reason to slap you silly, you... Ooh, that's like rude. 
know how I feel about that one. Hmm. That's better. Come on, Kyle. I think Nash knows what he did was stupid. I mean, really stupid. And if Mia didn't slap some sense into him, nothing will. I forgive you, Nash. I'm gonna keep my eye on you, of course, but I forgive you. Alex, do you forgive him, too? We're all friends, aren't we? Come on. We're all friends, aren't we? Besides, we'll need his help to stop Galleon. Welcome back, Nash. Mia. Everyone. Thank you. Tabin wasn't lying about the grindery. It's an armored castle that moves. In fact, it's very nearly complete. Once it starts moving, it can't be stopped, so we mustn't waste any time. What? Moving castle? I think you're still dizzy from that slap Mia gave you. It's all true, but no time for details now. We have to reach the activation room. Luna. Quickly, Alex. Take a drink every time, uh... Every time Alex says Luna. <laughs> Take a drink every time someone says Alex, or calls Alex by name. These switches look pretty cool, Alex. Do you think it's okay if I touch them? I don't think so, Null. I might blow this place up. I have an idea. I'll go outside and let Nash hit the switches. Wow. That way, if the tower blows up, he's the only one who gets killed. What do you think? I think you should shut up. Oh yeah, speaking. Oh, okay, so you have, like, stuff. You still have equipment. Uh, I, uh, you know what? Um, why don't you give him the fortune? Yeah, I know it's your treasure, Nash, but you kind of need stuff that's, like, better. That's okay. Um... Yeah, I kind of got nothing here. See how he likes the pendant? Yeah, I think that'll do. Oh, did I save the Did I save after that fight? Well, well. So you made it to the frontier at last. And e you even stole the title of Dragon Boy. But guess what, my dull little foil? You're too late. Really? Looks like we're right on time to pound you to a bloody pulp. Luna, where is she? Resting peacefully in a slumber of my design. But I shall awaken her soon. If you've done anything to her, you'll answer to me. I answer to no one, Rodent, and soon you'll witness the manifestation of that fact. Galleon! Whoa! Tisk tisk. Apparently our little hero isn't a patron of the theater. This isn't the time for our final confrontation, Dragon Boy. As any dullard with an ounce of culture knows, that time is reserved for the third act. Your amusing little trials and tribulations just brought our second act to a close. I do expect you to be a cooperative deer and save the best for last, Dragon Boy. Won't you play along? Ugh. Tabin. Yes, Master Ember. The grindery is operational. How lucky you are, human. You survived the journey to the frontier and the attacks of my magical weapon. And now you're alive to witness the most important event in the history of the world. No. We're too late. Magic systems initialized. Power output maximized. Behold, humans. Gaze upon my finest creation. The Grindery! What's happening? Galleon! Don't worry about him, Alex. Worry about us. We gotta go.
Well, there it goes. I'm not gonna lie, I was kind of expecting spider legs, but... But now that's cool. That's pretty cool. By the goddess. We're dead. We're all dead. What would happen if that thing attacked a town? They've got Luna in there, Alex. We have to stop it. But how are we going to cross the desert of death? Why, in the airship you tried to destroy, butt brain. Yeah, we need to have a little talk about that stunt later, Nag. We have to follow that monstrosity. For Luna's sake. We gotta go. Oh yeah, we'll be fine. Oh, whoops. Well, I might as well see. We gotta go. Oh wait, no, I have a spell for this. Wait, no, get out of this. What am I doing? Oh, I can't even use this spell. Oh, I haven't been up here. This just uh, has an enemy in it, really. Oh yeah, I snuck past this thing. Let's see if we can get out of here. Oh. Yeah, this is a neat little section, though. Kind of neat. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, I can just leave through the front. Heck yeah. Hold on, let me look at something. Let me look at one thing. Okay, there's nothing. Don't mind me. So we gotta make our way back to, uh... The mine, basically. We are gonna take a moment to use the statue. Wait, what? Oh, right. You have to go uh, quite a ways. In fact, I don't know. Should I uh, wait for... Uh... Eh. I'm trying to think if I should wait till next time to, like, try and... Well, I guess what I can do is I can at least get to the airship. Right? 
That I can at least do. And then we'll just kind of see what goes from there. And... I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. Because I don't think I'm going to finish it, like, tonight. But I definitely, it definitely feels like we're close. Oh. Well, that's kind of nice. The grindery is like Kyle, big and slow. We'll reach Vane long before Galleon does. There it is! The Grindery! But how are we supposed to get inside of it? We won't know that until we're close enough to look for an entrance. Yes, I know you're still nervous about flying, but you have to bring us in. I'm not nervous about flying. I'm nervous about whatever defenses this thing has. Oh, it's got a force field. No good, Kyle. It's shielded by a magic barrier. I might as well be trying to dig through a mountain with a toothpick. Galleon, you coward. We should have known he was afraid of a fair fight. Excuse me, but has anyone noticed the direction in which the grindery is moving? If I'm not mistaken, its current course will take it directly to Althena's tower. No. Galleon created the grindery not to terrorize the land, but to destroy Althena. Their combined power is unquestionably enough to do just that. No, no, I don't believe it. Athena created our world. Galleon could never hold that kind of power. But even if you're right, Mia, there's nothing we can do to stop it. There is, Jessica. But you have to take us to Vane. What? We have to get there before the grindery does. Every second is precious. Come on, Jessica, let's go. Okay. Punch it. As you can see, Mother, we don't have any other choice. The only way for us to stop the grindery is to use the true power of Vane. You're right, Mia. I'm proud of you for being able to make such a difficult decision. Tell me, Mia, why isn't Nash here to offer his support to you in this darkest hour? I don't think he has the guts to face you, Lemia. Kyle! Nash is at the transmission spring, helping to evacuate the city. I appreciate his efforts, Jessica, but I believe Kyle's theory also has merit. And I don't blame Nash, either. Any respect I once held for him has been lost. Oh, Mother, please don't say that. He knows that he made a grave mistake. Enough, Mia. This isn't the time or place to discuss this matter. Alex, please retrieve Nash. Mia, begin your preparations to enter the Silver Spire. I need help from all of you to do what I plan to do. Alex, I need you to find Nash and bring him back here as soon as you can. When you've both returned, we will all enter the Silver Spire. Okay, well, I'll go do that. Uh, next time, I think. But yeah, things are definitely ramping up. I, uh, I've been having a really good time with this game. Like, it's actually been really, really fun, all told. Uh, who should I bother today? Who should I bother today? Who should I bother today? Um, okay. I think I, I think. Bother. Um. Uh... 
X-ray don't even. today we learned that betraying your friends is uh, never really a good idea just not really a good one we also learned that uh, I don't know sometimes vibes can uh, can be accurate when it comes to uh, evil villains we also learned that uh, that you know you can't go wrong with a uh, with an extra balloon engine you never know when you need it Anyway, thank you for coming out to the Uncle Bandit stream. If you enjoyed streams like this, don't be afraid to leave a follow. If you want to help support the stream, you can also sub and donate. Those things really help me out. If you want to check out any old playthroughs, uh, playthroughs or keep up with any current playthroughs, you can head over to the Uncle Bandit stream archive over on YouTube.com. And if you want to keep up with any stream updates like playthrough announcements or just want to see what I'm up to, you can check me out on Twitter at Uncle underscore Bandit. This has been it for me. This has been Lunar Silver Star Story Complete. And I hope to see you all next time. <laughs>